40% of our state's water reserve is stored in Lake Mead, but the Colorado River, which feeds it, has been in drought for over a decade. The fiscal year 2018 executive budget summary discusses a plan that will help conserve water. Cronkite News reporter Holly Bernstein traveled to Lake Mead to see what impact the proposal could have. A new report by the Western Water Advocates shows Lake Mead is is being drained faster than it can be refilled. If it drops below certain levels, water access will be reduced. Farmers would be the first to feel the effects of the shortage, and those who depend on agriculture are already trying to prevent that. The Colorado River runs alongside Parker, Arizona. Many depend on the river for tourism and business, and the Colorado River Indian tribes rely on it for their primary economic activity, agriculture. It started off with our uh, canals being built years ago into watering our uh, farms. But there's less water in the river due to an extended drought lasting for close to 17 years. If you went up to Lake Mead, you could see that line that shows where it used to be and where it's now. Today, the water level stands at 1081 feet. If water elevation drops below 1075, 1050, or 1025 feet, the water delivery to Arizona and Nevada is reduced at each step. That means for those involved in water conservation efforts, it's all hands on deck. Bureau of Reclamation spokesperson Rose Davis says there's a chance of shortage in the next couple of years. Our current predictions based on our August 24 month study, which kind of sets out the water deliveries for the following year, says that in 2019 we've got about a 33 percent chance of shortage in the lower basin. The Colorado River Indian tribes have the oldest water rights on the river, and they would be one of the last to lose access. But the tribe proactively joined the pilot program to reduce their water use. We follow some of our lands, instead of farming on those lands, that water that would have gone there would go back into Lake Mead. The river is a big part of the Colorado River Indian tribe's culture, and Moses said they've been educating tribal members about what's happening. It's a little disturbing to people when you find that when they say, oh, you're not going to farm there because we've been farming for so long, you know, and then we say, oh, we're not going to farm there. Why not? According to the 2018 Executive Budget Summary, Arizona has been in negotiations with California, Nevada, and the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation to prepare a plan that will conserve water in Lake Mead. But there is a cost, and Arizona's share would be $2 million per year for three years. In the Broadcast Center, Holly Bernstein, Cronkite News.